Welcome back. May apat na laro na lang ang natitira sa regular season schedule ng Golden State Warriors. Pero ang apat na laro na yan, kailangan na lang lahat mapanalunan kung gusto nilang mabreak ang 72 win record ng Chicago Bulls. Ang problema, tila na burn out na yata ang Dubs sa paghahabol ng record na yan. Panahon na kaya para ipahinga na ng Warriors ang katalang key players para sa playoffs o ituloy nila ang quest for 73 wins. Para sa usapan na yan, kasama natin ang basketball blogger na si Adrian D. Wait, Aids, welcome back to the score. Great to be back. Well, we've been debating about this the last few times <laughs> we we've been on the score. Um, four games ago, mm. we, we saw this down the line. It's yep. going to go down to these four games. Spurs, Grizzlies, mm. Spurs, Grizzlies. <laughs> Pero may dikit na laban na dyan. Mm -hmm. Mayroong back-to-back. -back. So, uh, if you're Steve Kerr, mm -hmm. uh, and, and no, no observe mo yung mga nangyari the last few games, a loss to the Celtics, a loss to the T-Wolves, both mm -hmm. at home, right? right? Uh, what's happening to this team? Uh, as siguro, as sinabi mo kanina, na-burnout na nga sila. Mm -hmm. It's not a physical burnout na usually at this time players get tired, yeah. so like that. So it's more uh, mental, sila okay. so na-fatigue. Uh, mm -hmm. Draymond Green said at practice na na-bore na sila. All the talk about Bored, you know, okay. breaking the record. Oh. And, uh, hindi naman ibig sabihin na they, they okay na sa kanila na if they don't get the record, but mm -hmm. it's more of they want to get it over with na para ma-concentrate na sila nga so on playoffs. the playoffs. Yeah. Okay, okay. Well, um, I, I don't know what the latest statements of Steve Kerr were, but mm -hmm. I remember he said before, we're gonna go for number one seed. Mm -hmm. And uh, if the Spurs give him a chase, and consequently that right. means going for the record, fine. But now, mm -hmm. he also said uh, rest mm -hmm. is better than, than uh, records, or obviously championships are right. better than records, because the record will last for a year, but a championship. You know, or, sorry, he meant the records are broken. <laughs> Championships are keep them set forever. in stone. So when, you, yeah. when you see that mindset of a Steve Kerr, I, I'm sure because I'm, I'm sure because for him, he's been on teams. He's been on the team that he broke was on the that record. Team. He's yeah. been on many, on plenty of yeah. championship teams. Correct. So uh, I'm sure it's hard for him also to sort of weigh those two things. Yes. But I think uh, they've been using that the whole 73 wins thing as sort of uh, inspiration to get the number one record. Because if yeah. you think about it, in any other season. Siguro na clinch na nila yung number one seed, Correct. but the fact that this season the Spurs have also been so good, mm -hmm. they really had to push themselves Correct. to get that number one seed. And kaya, if you actually look at their schedule now, if they lose all of the remaining four games, which is a very small possibility, yeah. pero you know, you never know, mm -hmm. then the Spurs could actually overtake them. That's right. So so there is the sense that in this, especially this next game, which will be at the Oracle Arena against the San Antonio Spurs, mm -hmm. they really want to win that game because that would clinch the number one seed for them. Right, right. And siguro after that, they'll see, na, okay, how do you guys feel? Mm -hmm. lang nila, titignan, if they'll go after that record. Okay, but there are some outspoken guys there who want it. There are mm -hmm. some who are like, eh, we'll see, it's okay. Right. Um, yung kapit bahay nila sa California, a guy named Kobe Bryant, <laughs> an interesting thing to say. You know, yeah. I'm going for that yeah. record. You know, whatever you, mm -hmm. whatever you say about wrestling, wrestling, it's so rare to get a record. Mm -hmm. I mean, he's all about records now. He's that's a, why. Kasi mama tapos mentality. Yung, tapos yung championships niya eh. <laughs> <laughs> Kobe, isa pa lang sila eh, nakailang ka na eh, di ba? Exactly. So maybe that's why he has maybe. a mindset. But, but you know, um, as a fan, I mean, mm -hmm. how would the Golden Hit Warriors fans feel like now? Would they say, okay, we understand, magpahinga kayo, <laughs> or let's go for the record? I think they can't be too greedy because mm -hmm. I mean the Warriors haven't had a championship prior to last season in so such a long time and yep. the fact now that they have a chance to get back to back mm -hmm. it, it must make them very happy but then I mean as Stephen Curry himself himself said mm -hmm. Uh, there's a reason why everyone keeps talking about 72-10 because it's such a prestigious record. Right. It's always seemed mm -hmm. so unbreakable yep. until this point. So yes. if you're only a few games away, why not take that shot? And and to me, uh, just to rebut Steve Kerr, mm. this kind of a record is so rare that it right. can be broken. It's not like every year you see a, a record <laughs> broken of different you know categories. Exactly. Nah, manageable. It's mm. out of this world. Mm. So and you know, my my mind, like I'm thinking that's. I always remember them as the best team in the right. NBA, the best regular season record. If you ask me who are the champions since then, I'd forget. <laughs> exactly. Diba? I mean, championships, <laughs> championship teams, you kind of even forget some of them down mm -hmm. the line, but record-breaking teams are there. So what What we I'm, I'm sure the, 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 the fright there is, okay, you get the record, you yeah. break one up, but you don't become champion after that. That like Blame, blame game. Diba? Yeah, right? And then you can, you can start saying, oh, because we, we didn't do this, we didn't rest players. <laughs> in I the mean, last four diba? games? And then, it's na tal to okay. yung win breaking that record. And I'm mm. sure 
uh, I mean, the goal of the team is to win championships. Right. Oh. The goal of the team is not to break records. Right. So I'm sure that's also weighing on their minds. It's very difficult to reconcile, mm -hmm. as we said, that they've been using it as inspiration. But now that it's gotten to the point and uh, the situation is not, now they now have to sweep everything. They thought in the end, before, if we win a couple of games, we can rest in the end. That's off the table. For the end. Yeah, 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 correct, correct. Well, we'll see about that. But here's the thing. So they play the Spurs tomorrow and then right. a one-day break, mm -hmm. right? And then they play Memphis on Sunday morning mm. when they're at a time. And then back Spurs to back again. Spurs in a man. So, okay, let's say they win tomorrow. Okay. That means the Spurs are out. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, I don't have Spurs. Wow. And they say they easily win against Memphis, mm -hmm. whether or not they rest Spurs, because Memphis is so beat right. up. What will happen on that Monday morning game in a time? Yeah, yeah, Spurs? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What will Pop do? Because that's in San exactly. Antonio. Uh, one of the things we've noticed about Pavovic is he he actually he's very careful about these mm -hmm. records. In the All Star game, na lalo, na they really made an effort to guard Paul George, but he wouldn't get the scoring record in the All Star <laughs> game in the last possession. Uh -huh. So he, with Pavovic, if he thinks na, you know if he if he feels that uh, 72 10 is such an important part of NBA history, mm -hmm. who knows? He might like throw out and, all his players. And it will be in history books that. The last four games, right? Came two, wins two against came from the them. Spurs. So exactly. that will be, you know, a bit of an asterisk there. Course, Does he have that much pride vis-a-vis right. resting his players? Now, arguably, mm -hmm. I, I, had to, I have not done the math, but they have the older players. They do. <laughs> okay, I'm and, and that. We, we all know Paul, but yeah. he, his tendency is always to rest players. You know, for him, I, the long run is more important than these records. So there's that interesting conflict, talaga, between the two. So what if? So <laughs> this is there's a wild potential that the Spurs could rest their stars. Yeah. The Warriors could rest, rest their, their stars, stars all the time. So the bench will battle out for the record. And, and, and then there, there's also the... another record at stake that the Spurs can be undefeated at, at home. home. So <laughs> you, oh, no. the, we have Boban Marjanovic versus Murray Spates defending their record. I don't think it's happened. Um, the that closest I think is one loss home? by the 1986 Celtics, if I'm not mistaken. That's the best home record. That's the best home oh, record. Wow. So, but there's all sorts ay, of these ay, factors ay. between these two teams. And they've got a proud city full of proud fans. They're Definitely. not going to be like, come on, don't mm -hmm. give up this loss that easily. Be one of the last few losses exactly. against the Warriors. The Warriors. <laughs> And it's a team okay. that you don't want to give them the mental mm. edge going into the yeah. playoffs because then if, let's say, they win tomorrow, oh. they win again on, on Sunday, that's a 3-1 edge in the regular season series. So right. going into the playoffs, if they do meet in the Western Conference Finals, that's going to be very important so, mentally. So many things at stake <laughs> as well. So, But uh, after that, when is your next Memphis game? Ilang days ang pahinga nun? That would be on the same day as the last game of Kobe. So... Which that's, is a Thursday. It's a Thursday. So, so there's that Tuesday, whole, Wednesday off. Sila. So there's two days off. Interesting dynamic, rin, no? What mm -hmm. are you going to watch as an NBA fan? <laughs> <laughs> so, are you going to see history with Kobe Bryant's oh, last game? Or are you going to watch the Warriors try so to shoot for some? Uh, they're both West, West Coast games. So, so possibly it's sabay. possible. I'm going to say to you, we will be airing that special Kobe Bryant there game on abs Secret Sports in action. You put na pili na kami mga producers at ang mm. NBA. They collaborate for the schedule. And we'll be airing the Utah Jazz versus the Lakers on Thursday. And not the, <laughs> the Warriors versus the Grizzlies. I'm sorry about that. But, okay. I put you on the spot before. Okay. Let's put you on the spot again. again. <laughs> gut feel. Where do you think My gut make feel it? always has been that they will match the record, but they won't break it. But do. It's on the But what's interesting about that is that I mean, we always love to debate about these you things. Know, and oh. In this case, it's such a different style of basketball from when Michael Jordan played to yeah. now when Stephen Curry played. And I'm sure. If that does happen, we're going to hear all these debates over and over about yep. which team is better. Because right now, ngayon pa lang, Scottie Pippen is saying that they would sweep, sweep the Warriors. Them better. Sweep, sweep them better. Sweep them talaga. Ba? Ay, nako. So, lots of fun there. Oh, well. Well, if you want to continue debating with this guy, Chino Hoops <laughs> fan on Twitter. And when they, if they do make 73, you can tweet him and say, we told you so. We told you so. All right, AIDS, maraming salamat. No problem, We'll see you next DJ. week when this all, this all wraps up. <laughs> yep. All right. For more sports updates, keep watching The Score, and don't forget to subscribe.